This is for those of you that are transitioning from a DG700 to a DG1000 uh, for a blower door test. And the tubing connections will go from reference on channel A to the outside. And with the DG1000, um, instead of up down input reference, it's left right input reference. So we'll go reference uh, to, on channel A to the outside. And then input on B to the fan and input on B to the fan. And then we'll start up the DG700 and we'll first hit the mode twice to get the pressure flow at 50. The device is already at blow at R3. The config will switch to uh, B2 and then we'll do a baseline. So hit baseline and start And we'll let it go for a few seconds and then hit enter. And we'll hit start cruise. Start, start fan. push hold and then we'll move to the DG1000 and this is the startup menu and we'll click on the gauge app and um, we'll hit the mode area here to go from pressure to pressure flow at 50 and then the device is model 3 fan configuration we can change to B and then we'll go back and we'll hit the baseline and enter start cruise and hold Next, we'll show doing an automated test and generating a report using our TEC auto test app. So we'll launch that app. And we've already done a test for a, um, a builder, and we're going to do another test for that same builder. So we're just going to make a copy of that um, report. And we'll give it a, a different name. And we'll open that. And we're going to go to the building and customer information and determine location. So now we'll go out and search, use the geotag feature, and uh, we'll, it looks like we're in the right place. We'll choose use that location. Now it brought in the longitude and latitude, altitude, and the timestamp. And I'm going to use this address. Now it just populated the fields in our report, so we don't have to enter that information in there. All right. So I will open that test and we can enter, change the volume if we need to in here. And I'm gonna choose run test. We're gonna to connect to our gauge. We can see we're monitoring now so we can start the test. We'll enter in the um, indoor and outdoor temperature and it brought in the altitude from our geotag. We're gonna start our baseline. We can see it gathering all the data for the baseline now. And then it'll prompt us to um, to cover the fan and um, and and we'll uh, choose a ring. Now we can see our blower door is uh, ramping up, so we can adjusting for our 60 pascal pressure, and we can take our um, reading at 60 pascals, sampling for the data. Now we can see all our data fields are filled in and we're sampling our uh, data for our last target pressure at, at 10 pascals. Now the test is complete and we're going to choose yes, we want to view the report. So here's what the report looks like. And right front and center in the report in, in bold is our um, our leakage target at three air changes per hour, measured leakage, and uh, and we passed our test. So we can um, we can send that up 
to uh, to email or if we have uh, Google Drive or Dropbox on there, uh, we could send it up to the cloud that way.